Hey, what's up? Tony with Pet Talk. Uh, today we're going to be talking about respiratory infections with ball pythons or any snake or lizard um, and how I treat the reptiles here at Pet Talk. What we usually do is go with F10 treatment. So if you don't know what the F10 treatment is, look online, do a lot of research, um, order you a bottle, check it out. This is how to do it. I've also tried Tynon, P-Y-N-O-N-O-L, Tylon or whatever with some of the other snakes and stuff. I got a snake in here right now that this guy had respiratory really, really bad about three, four days ago. It was so bad to the point where it was coming out of his mouth. He had a lot of bubbles coming out. You see now he's got a lot of action with that tongue. He ate today, which was a plus. No more foaming at the mouth. Um, good thing. Looks like he's on his way. Usually with the F10 treatment, I treat him for a week or 10 days basically every two days i'll give them a new uh treatment of the f10 this snake is the snake we'll be treating today and um take a look at him See if i can show you if you look he's got all that film coming out of his mouth looking real nasty and slimy so um what i'll do is i'll take this guy and i build me a little box you know any kind of tub or anything Put him in and I can feel it, man. I really can like feel the stuff in here. It's like he's got a cold. I can feel him coughing and stuff. You can see it. You can really see that nasty stuff in his mouth. So we're gonna drop him in just like that. Then we're gonna move over here. Now F10, use the rectifogger with it. The way the F10 is um is used you want to do a five milliliters five milliliters to every liter so you want to put five milliliters to every liter so we're going to go ahead and uh break this up get this doing do what it do all right about right there and take it pour it in don't say shake it but i usually shake mine up just to make sure it's all uh, Mixed up pretty good. Drop it on top. Got a hole cut in my box here. And usually, uh, fit that right off in there. Anybody got a rip before they know that sound. Good old zoom in. And once you get your fiber to work. And stop making all these funny noises. Just leave them in there underneath the fog for about 20, 30 minutes. And then he should be good. And what you want to do, you want to just leave him in. And I, I, I turn mine up on full blast. I mean, you look at full blast, pretty good stream coming out of there. Don't really have much of the smell. Kind of smell like you're in the hospital. F10 is actually a cleaning solution that don't nobody know. Um, it's been used in different um, colleges and different veterinary clinics and stuff to help treat respiratory successfully. So try it out. We're going to follow this and um, two days from now I'll load another video. We'll look at the uh, actual progress of this, this snake and we'll see how it's going. So two days from now, definitely check back on. Pet Tiles Pet Store, YouTube, see the next step in treating respiratory infection. This is part one of who knows how many parts. All right, this day, second day of treatment. This was the original snake that we had. It's going to be a little difficult. I'm doing it um, by myself this time. Oops. So I figured I'd sit down and give you a look. Check him out. You see he's got that rapid action. No more foaming. Still got a little little bit of a tick. So if you look, don't see all that stuff we've seen before. There's still some there. Just not as much. I wish we could get a better view. So, remember last time how sticky it was? If you look now, it's not as much still. Still got a little bit coming out of his mouth. You can see some bubbles right there. Right there. Definitely not nowhere near 
as bad as how it was. So we're gonna put him in. This is gonna be second day of treatment. Second, third day, second treatment. So um, let's go ahead and drop him into the box. Heard that? There you go. Now you guys can see that he he's still kind of sick. He's getting better, but not as bad as he was. So let's put him in the box. Hey, how's it going? Tony here. All right, now we've got this snake in. This is day three. Um, we've been doing the F10 treatment. Um, covered the top of the screen up with a little newspaper, trapped some of it in. This snake has been under treatment for um, two days. We've been doing, uh, not two days, but three treatments every two days. So this is his third treatment and the six two, four, six day, six or seventh day right in there. So we've been treating for the week. Usually we'll put the newspaper in the bottom, catch all that residual. But he's been looking really, really good. Taking him out. See that face. A lot of rapid tongue movement now. No more of that, that nasty mucus coming out of the side here like it was. A lot more feisty, as you see. A lot more feisty. So, this guy's looking really, really good. Took about three treatments to get him, get him right. But, like I said, once you see, there's no more of that spit or mucus or whatever you want to call it coming out of his mouth. And as you see, he's fighting. He don't want to be held, so he's definitely a lot healthier than he was. Um, that's pretty much it. And this was an F10 treatment. Um, we did it for six days, 30 minutes inside the 10-gallon tank, covered up. And that was it. So, I really do believe he's good. I don't think I'll do another video. Um... If you got video if you got questions please um leave them on the bottom of the comment section be sure to like subscribe um pet tiles pet store you can find us on facebook um twitter instagram wherever all right man this is tony and this has been an f10 respiratory infection treatment